circuit shown here is called a differential amplifier or subtractor. And like the summer, this circuit has two inputs, one applied at the inverting end and the other applied end at non-inverting. And you can think of this amplifier or subtractor as a combination of an inverting amplifier and a non-inverting amplifier. And we can use the superposition principle to see what's the relationship between VO and V1 and V2. First of all, the output of V1 due to V1 is VO1 and you can see it's an inverting amplifier so it's minus R2 over R1 times V1. VO2 on the other hand you could see here at VP is a voltage divider due to V2 and that this is a when we zero out V1 this would yield the output due to V2 and that now this would be an inverting gain of R2 over R1 plus 1 so let's do the one associated with the voltage divider here which is R4 over R3 plus R4 so that's due to V2 and then here we have a gain of R2 over R1 plus 1. Okay. Now the output VO is due to each of these outputs. That is VO is equal to VO1 plus VO2. Substituting we have minus R2 over R1 times V1 plus R4 over R3 plus R4 R2 over R1 plus 1 times V2. Now we can put this in block diagram form where K1 is the ratio of negative R2 over R1 and that the constant K2 here, the scalar factor, is a result of these resistor products shown here. That is, all this expression here is equal to K2 and then this here is equal to K1. All right, and so this is our block diagram for our differential amplifier or subtractor. Now let's consider the special case when the ratio of R3 over R1 is equal to R4 over R2. When we have this constraint, this K2 can be reduced to the following. simply the ratio of R2 over R1. This implies now that VO is just R2 over R1 V2 minus V1. So we can see the output is proportional to the difference between V2 and V1. Hence this is our subtractor operation and I'll highlight our final result when this is result of this constraint but our general result VO is given by this relationship here and a block diagram is shown in this gear. That concludes the analysis of the op-amp circuit for the subtractor or differential amplifier.